Well, the last cabinet was formed to tackle the nation's sluggish economy, but it collapsed after too many people felt it made too little headway. The tax now falls to the incoming cabinet, which will also need to improve relations with ruling party lawmakers and continue pension reform. On their first day in office, Premier Zhang Yihua, Vice Premier Mao Zedong, and Secretary General Chen Weiren offered New Year's greetings to members of the cabinet. It was an easy day, but more difficult times lie ahead. The first order of business is to improve communication between KMT headquarters and the party's lawmakers. At the very least, I respect elected representatives, says Zhang. Before my administration began, I worked hard to hold early discussions with them. We will do what we can, and what we can't will be explained clearly. Challenges include pension reform and the fourth nuclear power plant. Opposition leader Su Zhenchang of the DPP named his top desire for the new cabinet. We hope that the new cabinet will make revitalizing the economy its primary goal, and we hope it can reach the three, four, five targets, says Su. Three represents average growth in salaries, four the upper unemployment limit, and five economic growth. These are the people's expectations. Su says he wants the new cabinet to take advantage of the better global economic climate to improve conditions in Taiwan.